Hello there, YouTube. It's your guy, Kent Pool Collects. I uh, just wanted to say thank you for everybody commenting on last week's videos. Really appreciate the uh, engagement, and I definitely think it uh, helps out the video. So uh, if you're kind enough, just uh, leave a hello there or let me know what you enjoyed about the video, what didn't you like about the video. But thanks again for sharing on the channel. We're starting at our up town target we're gonna see what we can find today a little toy hunt video it's your guy Ken Pool collects is the season for shippers we got a mr beast shipper going on and yeah i just feel like more and more as we get into the holiday season you're gonna see different shippers just an easy way to kind of bring in product maybe some different new product maybe some different restocks but Let's get to the main toy aisle, see what we can find today. Still got plenty of Transformers 1. Little Jurassic World sneaking in on our Hot Wheels. Pretty good stock of Hot Wheels there. Got some five packs, little Star Wars, Thundercats. Premiums, racer first going on. Got some Fast and the Furious, little moving parts, race and play. That's pretty cool. I like that card back. Cartooned. Wheel skates, little transformers there, Starscream. I don't know if I've seen the Starscream one before. It's kind of cool. Bumblebee. Got some monster jams. Very cool. What we got here? A little clearance masterverse. Uh, markdown on the dinos was 65 down to 45 so a couple clearance items there fun codes oh uh, we got a little wwe but looks like it's been picked uh, let's see got a hogan there Rhodes, Tony D'Angelo. So this is series 111. Got a Finn Ballard, Randy Orton, Greatest Hits, Elite Greatest Hits, Little Mattel. Got some Gundam, Beast, Sun Beast. Nice. Sage figures. Ah, they got a restock of the Vegetas. Uh, the other cool thing looks like October we're gonna start getting some of the like Super Seven figures. So that's gonna be cool to see on the shelves. Kind of the same price points as the figure arts. So I think that's cool for uh, people that maybe aren't as familiar with some of the Super Seven figures. Smackdown, got a Trish Stratus series 111. Oh, they got a Sandman, that's cool. I think that was the only one we didn't see was Sandman. Uh, any chance he is hiding here? Let's see. Nope. Is there a Sandman? Nope. Those are Cody's. No way, this isn't another Hogan. Yeah. 
All right, so we'll have to keep our eyes out for the Sandman, the series 111. Got some Star Wars. Got some Squadron sitting. Buzz and Woody. Prince Adam. Splinter. <laughs> Turtles. So of course the uh, Donatello's gone, but that could have been from last week too. So we'll put those turtles back up. Got some street sharks hanging out. <laughs> Got a couple of the Bebop and Rocksteady down there. That's funny. Turtles. Godzilla. Godzilla, got the Jurassic World going on. Look at this guy. That's pretty wild. More Transformers. All right, basic Marvel. We do have the McFarlane statue. A little Spider-Man going on there. Oh, a little Deadpool. Okay. That's kind of cool. And you can see two different spider man So you got the gold label, plus you got the regular release. There's Wolverine, Iron Man back there. So that's pretty cool. I wonder, uh, issue one, will they just keep building that out with the X-Men? That could be kind of cool. But yeah, little uh, issues and inspired by the comics. Sonic, some Mario, get the build <laughs> Minecraft down there. Saw that they're gonna do a Minecraft movie. That should be interesting. is uh that's kind of scary wow these are like the jacked up ones whoo couple pokemon let's go around this way and we got some empty baskets that's always good all right got a little thing there i like marbles thing got an iron man chilling it's like the only Marvel legend, huh? Transformers, pretty stocked up. Makes sense with like the movie and everything. Quite a few figures. They also got uh, the display. So I'm sure they're hoping that uh, draw in some new Transformers fans. Maybe hit some spots with those older Transformers fans. There is... Uh, Springer, Megatron, a few Optimus Primal, four packs. Is that Tim Drake? Got some Simpsons here. GI Joe. All right. Let's go around the corner here and we'll see what the NECA display. Well, I guess it's not just NECA. They got some different turtle stuff going on. So it's still quite a bit. I'm kind of surprised. Plenty of the Stomp wrestling, plenty of the Bebop Roxetti. Got the Pizza Tosser. Still got like one of each character across that main shelf there toilet taxi so yeah you'll have to let me know what uh, turtle stuff are you after and looks like we still got some turtle stuff at Target we're in the collector's spot all kinds of different items tuning tears got some Wednesday look at 
the Joker up there hanging out. Got some Gundams, a little Dragon Ball, Batman, the animated series, quite a few Funkos. Check out some of the uh, turtles, that's kind of cool. Got uh, like some Care Bears, some Stranger Things going on. Little Brave Heart Lion, very cool. <laughs> Star Wars, Rebel Moon, X-Men, got the Mophone, Biddy Pops, got some different Marvel inspired uh, comic bags, Gargoyles, a little bit of Turtles, but uh, nothing too crazy going on in our collector spot. I'm gonna look around, but that's probably gonna do it for this Target store. Cross town, we're at the South Tryon Walmart. No pickups at Target. Let's go see what we can find inside. Tronics, we're in the collector spot. Got some Gundams there. A little last Ronin going on. Talk about some Turtle 2 packs. Super 7 going on. Yellow Ranger, Funkos, Dragons, Fyra, got some Netflix, little Chainsaw Man, Let's see if Biker Mice may be uh, buried there, a little bit of Spawn, There's some more of the uh, Biker Mice. Eve scoops of boy uh, overstocking. Still got the turtles up there if you're looking for the last Ronin turtles. Megan and some Funkos and stuff here. Let's go check out the main toy aisle and see what we can find today. In 12, starting off with a little bit of die cast. Got the restock of the Mario Brothers van. Got some mystery stuff. The pullbacks. Color shifters. There's some of those two packs. Not sure why Batman is racing Wonder Woman. Uh, maybe they're a team. I don't know. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Some of the different racer purse, super rigs, stars and stripes. Got some matchbox going on. Moving parts. Monster trucks. Some cars. Skates, tech deck, a little bit of Star Wars. Check out uh, the little turtle van there, that's kind of cool. Fast and Furious, a little bit of NASCAR. All right, got some RC stuff. What we got? Wrestling, got the car. Kurt Angle, Bobby Lashley, Bret Hart. Fortunately, Bobby looks like he is done with the, the WWE, which is too bad. AEW going on. Got some SummerSlam figures. Jim, got some of the retro cards. He Man, a little bit of Masterverse up there. That's kind of cool. Kane and Mankind. Mr. Beast. What is this? That looks pretty wild. Huh. 
Simpsons. More Simpsons. Demon Slayer. A little bit of Mario going on. A little bit of Sonic. Video games going on. Minecraft. Among Us. It's got the penguins, some rainbow friends, some Pokemon. Got balls. Kinetic sand, little display there. Transformers. Kong and Godzilla. Despicable me. More turtles. How's it going? Friendly Associates. Those newer turtles. Uh, wing bats. Superfly. Got some movie turtles. Fugglers. Got some Iron Man. Yep, the usuals. More Iron Man and Spider. We see them all the time. Got the Black Widow there. Basic Marvel. More basic Marvel. Dinos. Plushies. Right, check this out. A platinum, black and white Adam West. That's kind of cool. Should say him. We've seen Batman, Plastic Man wave. Got those Max Mercury's. So is it only gonna be the one Adam West? It sure looks that way. Wow. I thought maybe we were gonna see like all the different McFarlane. Uh, they either got scooped up or uh, maybe they're still in the back. Interesting. Star Wars Squadrons. Got a bunch of basics. More Squadrons. Black Series going on. Looks like a little bit of the Acolyte in there as well. All right, I'm going to look around and uh, we'll see what else we can find at Walmart. Little Saturday toy hunt. Nothing too crazy, but uh, a few things on the shelf, depending on what you're looking for. That uh, Adam West black and white, that was kind of cool. Kind of cool to see. Uh, both collector spot seem to slow down a little bit. Again, those McFarlane, I've seen people find like tons of Platinums. So either they haven't been put out or maybe everybody's scooping them up. That's a, that's a possibility. Series 111 WWE Elite figures. So some new WWE out there. Not much with G.I. Joe or Star Wars, the old Marvel Legends, so Hasbro, we'll have to see if we get a push out of them. Uh, a lot going on with uh, Transformers 1 and, you know, with Hasbro owning those Transformer rights. I'm sure they're hoping for a blockbuster movie, make some money there, sell some figures with uh, the Transformers 1. So we'll have to see how uh, how the movie goes and how them figure sales go. 
it's uh it's been an interesting year and we're getting closer and closer third and fourth quarter you know fourth quarter everybody tries going strong finish the year makes make that money them retailers so i'm sure there'll be some good stuff out and again probably more i feel like target and walmart's have gone heavier on the shippers so we'll see what uh shippers start hitting now not to say every shipper is like brand new toys we've seen plenty of restocks just happen to have uh you know that name on there whether it's uh the marvel legends or it's star wars or it's transformers so we'll just have to see how uh how those drop how those go uh your guy getting ready for a game day michigan texas gonna be a big game so fingers crossed michigan uh defends the big house and a huge win for us today here's hoping here's hoping so yeah a little bonus video nothing too crazy but little target little walmart if you are looking for those harry potter uh miniverse <clears throat> i think those go pretty cool with 112 scale so if you're doing some magic some spooky stuff with uh kind of halloween coming up your guy and uh the old mythic legions uh, i think our guy swig he's like a potion maker some potions better than others mostly bad potions but uh some of those are fun little little props that you could throw into some photography and whatnot so check out uh friday fun day display if you want to kind of see the scale i think the only thing that i felt was really off is the tables are like super small but they're made to fit like in the little ball that you get so i guess that makes sense as far as like the system of the toy but uh tables were a little small as far as 112 scale which is how you know how short the tables were but uh you know again don't look awful if uh you know fantasy setting dwarfs goblins on the uh, little bit of the shorter end and then uh you did have some bigger potion bottles but uh kind of like i said in the video maybe uh stole it from somebody or again it's fantasy so you're gonna have these different sizes and uh kind of representation in a fantasy realm even if you did like dr strange and stuff could be uh, kind of fun or like didn't McFarlane do some Harry Potter figures so options fun photography or if you just like mini figs or you got uh, mini verse and some little collectors in your household fun kind of mixing up the potions and stuff unfortunately I didn't have a ton of time to actually mix up the potions but I was pretty happy with uh, the props that came with it but i hope you enjoyed this video hopefully it's an awesome weekend for you a little bonus coverage before uh, i go check out the game and hopefully still in a good mood <laughs> uh i i've tried not to let the old football uh you know ruin the day ruin the weekend but uh we'll see what happens Thanks for jumping in. If you want to be a channel member, $1.99 a month gets you early access to the videos. And uh, thank you to anybody supporting the channel in that fashion. Until next time, always be hunting, have fun collecting. Go 